So when I reached out to her to be cartoonified, I knew that it was going to be great. Welcome to Ray Purpose Made, where I, Reynaldo, show you the ins and outs of some of my furniture projects. I try to always incorporate art into the furniture making process so that each finished piece is custom and one of a kind. Check out how I do it. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel to see what's coming up next. As I was creating this piece of this, she reached out to me and said that she wanted a piece for her mother inspired by Klimt's The Kiss painting, something more curvilinear. So that's where this one comes from. Creating abstract art from a painting that already looks abstract isn't that easy, especially when the medium I'm using is liquid epoxy. So what I wanted to do was create a radial kind of pattern that progressively got lighter as it went to the center of the platter from browns and golds and yellows to high yellows to white. And it kind of worked out, but not so much because my floor is not even at all. So it wasn't as central as I wanted, but the idea is there. And, and then I just kind of splattered some um, blues and reds onto the piece very randomly, like a kind of slight little spots of the Klimt painting that I saw. But bigger than that, um, I really wasn't feeling the piece in certain stages because the underside is gold and the rim was white, and it just really wasn't popping. So what I did was I kind of mirrored the colors that are on the surface down to the side of the rim. The inner rim of the handles stay gold, but the outer rim of the whole platter mimics the color that is right on top. So it really looks cohesive and it really like just continues from like top to side. And that's what I like about this one. Viv's grandfather very recently passed away, and in honor of him, I wanted to create a, a placard for Viv, some, a little piece that she can like, kind of have on a mantle or just hang up that has some information about him. He's a Christmas baby, so I put his birthday, um, the zodiac constellation, and like a little Sagittarius symbol along with the infinity in his honor. I got the Descartes, I think, therefore I am quote from Viv's Instagram page when she posted about her grandfather, and all the other information is just his birthday information. But I wanted to add a little bit more and definitely not be too busy, so I added the infinity symbol. And all the while, I was kind of seeing this as being like symbolic of an angel or a butterfly, like with wings. So I wanted the infinity to just be more than just the basic infinity. I wanted to kind of make it more like flourished, more robust. So I added uh, another line and kind of did like the three-dimensional look with my woodbird pattern. Thank you for watching my video. Stick around, there's a little bit more, but I want to take this time to ask you to like, share, subscribe, follow my page. I post twice a week, and if you hit that little bell in the bottom, you'll be notified when I do. And if you want to see more of my work or want your very own Ray Purpose piece, you can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, Etsy, and Gmail under Ray Purpose. Thank you.